Good evening, everyone. We're at the home of the Schwarzgelben, as they're known here in Germany, Borussia Dortmund, and what a venue this is. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting next to me here on the commentary gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham United midfield man, Stuart Robson. And we've got so much to look forward to. This is where it all begins in Europe's Premier Club competition, the UEFA Champions League, the group stage, match day one action. It is Borussia Dortmund against Atletico Madrid. Well, I'm looking forward to this one, Derek. It's so important that you get off to a good start. So let's hope both sides go for the win here and we get an exciting match. Brandt plays alongside Marcel Zabitza in the centre of midfield and the striker of choice is the powerful and lethal Sebastian Allaire. And the contest begins. Very quick thinking there. Ian Matson. Sancho now. And Dortmund exploiting the space on the flank. And the cross into the middle. And striking it on the volley. Just no luck. Well, good technique, but just wide of the target. be the player to decide the outcome to determine the course of events no reason at all why it won't be this man Stuart what do you anticipate seeing from him well Derek his outstanding attribute is his pace not just over the first few yards but over longer distances as well and that makes him so difficult to play against defenders are unsure whether to get tight or drop off a dynamic player Atletico get the free kick decision their way That's a good looking ball and well positioned to clear. He has teammates around him. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Marcel Zabitza. And slipped through beautifully. To jump in front. Oh, good save. Well worth, I think, at this stage, going back to the chance from earlier. Can someone get on the end of this? Zabitza. It is a decent looking attack here. But quick thinking defensively. Atletico might fancy their chances from this position. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. Saul and he's made headway well there was impending danger but good defending Madsen now with Allaire 
bad challenge and now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next and a yellow card it's going to be Stewart yeah the ref's got that right it's a yellow card all day long Marcel Zabitza Brandt with it Borussia Dortmund have given it away Morata it's with Saul a lot of momentum to this Atletico attack can he find the angle teammate available and it goes the goal for 1-0 and that changes the dynamic Well, let's look at this again. He's done superbly well to pick out a teammate here. And from there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal. Well, back underway here. And a wake-up call for Borussia Dortmund, you would think. Saul. Well, the defenders know they need to get tighter. Sound piece of defending. Marlon and defensive play to be applauded Saul Griezmann encouraging this from Atletico Griezmann and at the second time of asking it's a goal the keeper meanwhile looks to the heavens Well, here it is again, and I don't think it's good enough from the goalkeeper, you have to say that. He spilled it right into the danger zone, and at this level, you're always going to be punished. So, the ball rolling again at 2-0. Ian Madsen. The ball with Zabitza. Brandt. Man. Freedom for Morata. Morata. The referee has decided to give the free kick to Atletico. Ready at the far post, Morata here. Well, threat over for now. Almost at the end of the first 45. And oh, Derek, this is a big moment here. And oh, it's in. We cannot declare this contest over. They still believe. Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the people can do about that. Just when Simeone thought everything was going his way, he now has to get his team refocused and back on track. And they get the ball moving again. Dortmund still behind, but they're making this a contest. Marcel Zabitza. Ian Madsen. Marco Reus. That's a good-looking pass. Well, nothing productive, really. Uh, maybe room here for the counter-attack. Oh, he's lost possession. Sebastian Allaire. Marcel Zabitza. And that is going to close the book on the first half here in the Ruhrpott. 
Well, a more than decent showing in the first half from Sebastian Allaire. Keen to get your take. So into the second half, and as far as Borussia Dortmund are concerned, it's all about bouncing back. That's a lovely ball. Good use of advantage for Dortmund. Marlin. Well, they continue their push for the equaliser, but definitely not forcing it. And cleared away. Brandt. Aller. Incisive pass. He can't hold on to it. And holding on to it at the second time of asking. It's a good Dortmund move in the making. Well, the Dortmund fans are demanding they get the ball forward quickly. They can sense a change in fortunes here. Now the keeper wanted to take it cleanly and did. Sebastian Allaire. Brandt with it. Zabica. His fans won't tire of seeing that again. Oblak with the save. Well, just listen to the fans. They know this is a big chance here. Well, they fancy a short one. Nice cuts inside. What's next? Really sound defending. And the keeper showing tremendous command. <laughs> Favouring the short one. Brandt. Sound piece of goalkeeping. So a half an hour remaining. That's very effective use of advantage in favour of Atletico. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Well, not cleared away completely. Looking for the right angle. And angling it back. Reading it well. And that'll be offside. It is... An Atletico substitution. And Dortmund, would you believe it, are making a triple substitution. Well, Dortmund have certainly bossed the possession over the last 15 minutes and they've created chances it just now needs one of those chances to be taken but you feel it's coming yes who knows maybe another opportunity in the works for them spot on with that tackle this might be ideal for the counter Ray Nildo Llorente Zula stops it Rioson. 
Well, if these Dortmund players aren't inspired now, they never will be. These fans have been brilliant. Well, Dortmund being afforded too much room. Firing it towards goal. Oh, a goal! The equaliser! They completely changed the equation! Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength, and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal. Well, you can see his frustration. They've just lost their focus here. Well, it has taken a Herculean effort for them to get back to level pegging under these trying circumstances. And still trying to get forward, Griezmann. Who can he pick out? These Dortmund fans can sense a victory here, but the winner has to come soon. Not much time left now. Can he finish this? Replay and confirmation that he did get a touch on the ball. Unfortunately, it wasn't enough to prevent the goal. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Nice ball to switch the point of attack. It is going to be a Dortmund free kick. And here's a change now for Atletico. Decision is one of offside here. Hermoso, well, almost at full time, not quite, and it's a marginal lead for Borussia Dortmund. Stuart, what have you made of their performance? Well, their attacking play has been excellent today. However, by throwing so many players forward, they've looked vulnerable at the back, which is why this will be a nervy finish. They just need to hold on here. And well positioned to clear. So into the final five minutes and fed forwards and the flag does go up offside Marcos Llorente now Correa Atletico Madrid know they're not going to get too many more chances time is a factor okay and still looking to get the shot away well at this stage of the game you have to be more ruthless well that just might be their last chance what a miss that is
Kobel. Now with Zule. Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have three extra minutes. Rami Ben Sabaini. Yes, time to play is over. And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. Full time then, and the ideal start for Borussia Dortmund. They have three points from their first match in the Champions League. Well, you always want to get off to a good start, and that's exactly what they've done here. Now they can look forward.